I thought it was very yeah. odd that um, it seems that Gwyneth Paltrow and Meghan Markle are quite close and friends. Or, I mean, just from what we're getting here. Uh, but she did, Gwyneth did post her support for Kate, which is a bit awkward. Yeah. Well, Meghan Markle wants to be the new Gwyneth Paltrow. She's desperate to be there with this lifestyle guru, being all, all things cool, being with the new cool jet set in California. The problem is the cool jet set don't want to be linked with Meghan. She doesn't realise what she's done, really, by slating the royal family, that the, the nasty lies she's told about our Kate and King Charles are just unforgivable. And America actually loves the royal family so much. And I think, really, Meghan has really shot herself in the foot here. And I think if we, you know, there is no comparison between her and Kate, but then we look at Kate. She's going through chemotherapy. She's mm. suffering with cancer, but then there she was, looking so wonderful. You know, you saw that a touching side where she was with her children and there's little Louis Lovely. who always sort of steals the thunder. What's Louis going to do next? And she, she, you know, puts her on her lap. She's such a wonderful woman, mother and everything we admire. And she has a real sense of duty. Sadly, everything Megan hasn't got. And I thought it, it, it was really mean of Megan to even post on this day, to even, you know, dog business. It's for goodness sake. Um, mm. and, and she's going on with this brand because she's desperate to be linked with this sort of, you know, Gwyneth Paltrow set, cool set. She, you know, she wants to be the next sort of like, like the Obamas. But sadly, it's not going to happen. And I think slowly they're beginning to realise it. That's why they need to come back to England. But whether mm. they'll be welcomed is another matter, Nana.